But structure is only half of what makes a story great. The other half is storytelling. And to get an idea of how Dramatica works with that side of the creative process, let's take a look in the Story Points window. Just as the Story Engine favored a structural approach, the Story Points window favors a storytelling approach. The Story Points window lists all of the story points that Dramatica tracks. They're listed in the Appreciation column, and here you'll find such things as the story's goal and the main character's problem or drive. The Item column will tell you what structural item you may have chosen, or Dramatica Story Engine may have chosen, to fulfill that story point in the overall drama. The Definition column explains how that particular structural choice does fulfill that particular story point. And then there's this big blank column under Storytelling. This is where the creative writer, who's an inspirationist, who likes to first work out some ideas before creating a structure, can go to jot down thoughts, notions, and get some creative inspiration. You don't have to first create a structure in order to go to the Story Points window. If you start up a new file in Dramatica and you haven't created a structure at all, all these story points will be here, and a generic definition will be here, but the item will be missing because you haven't made any structural choices. This is where you can go then to describe your story's goal, for example, without ever knowing what Dramatica says the goal ought to be. So if you prefer to work your ideas out by following the Muse, you can just scroll through this list and fill in the scores of story points, some of which are highly detailed, and begin to really get to know your story, get all those creative notions out of your head and into the software so you can refer to them later as you finally begin to find and refine the structure in your story based on the work you've already done creatively. To enter storytelling information, whether or not you have a structure yet, you simply find the story point in which you're interested and double-click in the storytelling column. Now you can fill in whatever thoughts or notes that you want to take about that particular aspect of your story. And whatever you type in here automatically appears in the Story Points window and also throughout the entire software program everywhere storytelling is called upon. So, just as the Story Engine is always working behind the scenes to ensure that all of your dramatic choices are structurally sound, the Story Points information is constantly being broadcast back and forth throughout the software so that any place you enter information, it appears wherever else you might want to revise it, refine it, or replace it with something else. In this manner, Dramatica covers both the story structuring and the storytelling side of story development, ensuring that those who like to create a structure first and then write from that structure and that those who like to follow the muse first and then find and refine the structure have tools that will work for them. In the end, both kinds of writers will have developed a story with flawless structure and masterful storytelling.